gorgeous. Welcome back to The Tonight Show. Thank you for having me. It's always my favorite. I love that you're here, and I love that you come on our show. And I, I'm so, I want to say, I want to say congratulations to you. Newly engaged. I sure am. Now, come on. Whoa. <laughs> now, yes. how was, tell me about the proposal. Was it a surprise? Was it planned? I secured the rock. My work here is finished. Yes, I, you did it. I'll just let myself go now. No, um, well, I, I, I wasn't necessarily surprised because I was like, listen, you know, I, I'm out here on the streets. You gotta lock it down. Okay. And I was like dropping hints left and right. I was like, babe, wow, my nails look so good. <laughs> and we went to Mexico um, for the holidays and he, I guess, set up this whole grand thing and then that fell through. And so on Christmas Eve, he was setting up this dinner on the balcony um, but I thought it was Christmas Eve dinner because I thought Christmas Eve was reserved for baby Jesus. So that, I was like, oh no, I, I, it's probably not gonna happen tonight. And then it sure did. Wow. It sure did. You shared the, the evening with baby Jesus. <laughs> with tiny baby Jesus. Yes. And, and you had this beautiful dinner and you go, yeah, it's just perfect. It was amazing. Yeah, I, you, I'm so happy. And you told me that the ring is very uh, extra special to you. Why? Yeah, so he worked with um, this Vietnamese um, family-owned uh, jeweler from Canada, Paris Jewelers, um, to make it. And he knows how important um, my heritage is to me. And he knows that paying it forward means a lot to me as well. And so he worked with these beautiful ladies there. Um, and I'm... I'm so happy, and I, yeah, I can't believe it. I'm so happy to see you. This is great. How did you, uh, how did you uh, first meet? Well, we met at an Emmy party, and I slid in. I got his digits, and I, as we were leaving, I was like, oh, hey, hey, hey. Um, I thought of this joke, um, but I forgot the punchline. Can I have your number? And then when I remember it later on, I'll just text you. And so wow. that's how I got, that's yes. That's a I, good move. A smooth criminal. And, and yeah, so then I texted him like 30 minutes later and I said, well, well okay, um, what do you call a pile of kittens? What do you call a pile of kittens? A meowton. <laughs> a and, me a, a meowton, and that's, meowton. that's how you get a fiance. There you go, and that's <laughs> exactly right. It worked out perfect. <laughs> Um, you know, it is it's Nana Week here at the show. Uh, would you like to give a shout out to your grandma? Yes, my grandma loves your show. Um, so, hi, grandma. Hi, grandma. Look, it's my, it's my friend. Look, Lana's <laughs> doing great, grandma. <laughs> We're giving you. you a big hug. <laughs> uh, that's so good. Um, uh, I want to talk about your movie, uh, Moonshot. Moonshot. Oh, oh, Cole really wishes he was here. He funniest. sends his love. He's, he's the best. Th I love Cole Sprout. Yes, he's he, awesome. He is a fun human being. It Honestly, it was so much fun to work with him. It felt like we shot it last summer. It felt just like we were at, like, daycare, weirdly, like, all every single day on set because we were always just having so much fun. And <laughs> it's about basically these two people who are stuck in a spaceship together um, traveling through space and time to get to their loved ones. So it's like an adventure rom-com but like that's I feel like not even a genre like I feel like that's like such a niche you're starting a new genre like a sci-fi weird rom-com is what it is so if that's a sci-fi rom-com <laughs> yes. yeah this is brand new no one's seen anything like it uh, I want to show everyone a clip here's Lana Condor and Cole Sprouse in Moonshot take a look at this not under any circumstances leave my room, okay? What? I will sneak you in food, there's a bathroom, it'll be like camping. Okay, clearly you've never gone camping before and I I'm not going to spend my first trip through space on the toilet. Because you prefer the air ducts? Because what do you think happens when two people are trapped in the same room together? When two humans are confined for an extended period, it results in either more humans or fewer humans. <laughs> well done, Lana Condor, everybody. Moonshot begins streaming this Thursday on HBO Max. We love you. Thank you for coming. Thank you so Thank much. Congratulations. I'm so happy. Hey, hey.